Hey guys, we arrived in our home here in Merida, Mexico. We'll be here for the next couple of months. I'm gonna give you a tour of our Airbnb here. All right, guys, here we are on the outside, starting in here. So the doors have a lock inside and outside. Um, so you lock the door from both sides. Uh, this is the garage. If you're renting a car, you'll have a place to store it inside and a parking place always. And we get full-size washer dryer here as well, which is awesome. So this is the entryway, the full entryway, and it goes right into this nice courtyard here. But before we get to that first bedroom, we have a half bathroom right down here, fully equipped um with the sink and a toilet nice half bath to have downstairs this is the courtyard area they've got it decorated so nice it's a beautiful you know mexican style home which is an indoor outdoor feel so this is we have our college daughter with us so this is the room that she is staying in and it is a nice sized bedroom here. She's got her own TV in the room as well. And there are a couple of fans in here. And then there's also one there. Uh, I guess in the summertime it does get quite warm, but the room also does have an air conditioning. So that's really great. Um, basically self-sustaining space here for her, for um, hanging out on her own doing her own thing, nice bathroom here. And this is a full bathroom. Um, so you got your sink, you've got your toilet and a nice shower in here too. And the house does come with a housekeeping service. So they do come once a week and clean the house for you. And uh, that's really nice to have that service to keep everything nice and clean. So everything is like an inside outside. You could lock all of these if you were going away. Um, but when you're here and you're sleeping here, there's really no need. This is a really safe place to stay. Um, so coming into the main part of the house here, guys, we're using the dining room table as our office. As you can see, our computer's there, uh, ready to get some work done. And then we'll hop right into the kitchen here. It has a nice bar area. It's got the three stools here and there's three of us, so that's perfect. Um, and the cooktop is right here on the top of the island. And we've got a microwave and we have a nice oven as well. So that's really great. And then we've got all of the utensils and silverware, plates, everything that we need. And of course we are in Mexico. So, <laughs> uh, came with a, a bottle of tequila as well, which I thought was quite humorous. We've got a toaster as well, and then a full-size refrigerator, which is pretty awesome. We've got a pantry here in the kitchen as well, and they keep that stocked for us. Um, so they'll bring us paper towels and trash bags and things like that, and then we just obviously supply our own food. And then on the other side of the kitchen, we've got also some shelves down here. And we've got some nice pan assortment, and we've also got a blender. And then we've got our nice sink area. Now this is all um, poured concrete, all of the shelving, everything, um, the sink, and it's so nice um, and smooth, just like you see on the floor as well, has got the tiles in them. And then the water here is uh, pretty safe to drink but they do provide us with drinking water as well. And it's in this really cool little container right here. And you can just get your water right there, which is really kind of great to have that. And they have it decorated really quite nicely. Again, it's very important to keep airflow here. So you've got this door here, um, and we usually keep the screen door open, but it's also a slider, which you can lock. And you've got some fans here, so it helps airflow keep the house really nice and cool. The temperature is great because it's mostly concrete, so it does stay cooler for the most part. Uh, here's our couch area, living area, where we can hang out at night and just sit here and read, or we can play games. And then we've got this great area out here in the backyard. We've got our pool, and once a week we do have a pool man who comes and does 
the cleaning of the pool. But in the meantime, of course, we can always do a little bit of cleanup ourselves if we want to, if there's lots of leaves and such in the pool. But it's nice and clean and they keep this area really nice. There's a nice little area back here you can lay out. And then we've also got these nice chairs, which are actually quite comfortable to hang out in. So that's really nice to have. They've got these knobs built in here too to hang the towels to dry. And then we've got, uh, they do provide towels for us. We have them in here because it was raining yesterday and we don't want our towels to get soaking wet. <laughs> uh, okay, so this is what it looks like from this angle. You can see the upstairs, which is where the master suite is. We'll go up there in just a second and take a look at that. But this whole area down here is really great. Great space, um, like I said, great airflow from this side all the way to the other side. As you can see, these windows up here are actually um, sliders as well. And they've got this cord here so that you can close the window up top or open it. So that's really great. And then there's also an air unit in here. You really just don't need it, but they've got this nice uh, electric shades and you can put them down if the sun is coming in really harsh during the day, you put those down and it makes it nice, a little bit cooler in here and a little bit darker if you don't want that much sun coming into the house. Um, so those come actually all the way down. So let's go ahead and head upstairs to the master suite. Uh, the stairs are lit here from below and also from above. It's really nice that they thought to put so many fans. Look at, again, this pretty design here on the floor. So many fans into the room, but here it is, our master bedroom. So we've got a TV up here as well, and we've got that great balcony and view. We'll look at that in just a second. And then we've got our nice bed here. We also have a look down to the entrance courtyard of the house, which you can see here. So that's really nice. You get daylight coming in from there and daylight coming in from the other side. So let's go ahead and head into the master bathroom. Again, decorated really well. This is a really great use of space. We've got the double sinks again. This is that beautiful um, concrete, poured concrete. And we've got this great shower in here and have pretty much anything that we need nice hot water the flow is really good as well so this is our closet here it's a pretty large um, closet really for a home like this both sides and it also has a fan and a light as well as here in this main part of the bathroom so we do have an air conditioner in here but um, again, with the airflow, if you open up this window here, um, you're going to get really good air coming in also from the other side. So what I love is this space here, which is what I'll finish up on. And you've got this great view basically of the whole house and all the space here. And if those shades are up all the way, you get nice light coming in. The nice thing is you put those down at night and you kind of get a little bit more uh, dark time hours if you're trying to sleep in. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, make sure to subscribe to the channel, guys. Don't forget to give me a like, and I will catch you at our next Airbnb.